Hey guys, I got some uh, quick updates and uh, some status on the sale, which is uh, actually not much of a status at all, really. Um, I think the only person who's really taken me up on it is uh, Minovade. Uh, I'm working on a couple uh, liners for him. Here's a prototype Nick, if you happen to catch this. Um, it, uh, the video doesn't really capture the color. It's just like I was telling you, Nick, I just could not get the color to show through on the camera. It looks blue on the camera, but it it is purple. I mean, it really is purple. Um, let's see if I can get that to focus on that edge. It's about an eighth of an inch thick. Let's see if I can get some better light here. There we go. So it's about an eighth of an inch thick. Um, man, I wish you could see the actual color. Um, like I said, this is a prototype, so there's some little divots and stuff like that. Because I've never actually done a just a liner by itself. Um, you don't need as much pressure, I found out, and ruined the back of it, pulling it out of the the jig, my press jig. So I'll probably just give you this one for free and make you the real ones. But for the most part, it's not bad. The edge of this feels really nice. It feels just like a piece of plastic or G10. I mean, you look at it, it looks like a piece of plastic. Nice and clean. So I'll make you a couple other ones. Um, perfect ones. I won't have any of this on it. I know you're probably sand through it anyways, but I... I like to send out stuff that's perfect, so there's that. Um, I made a canvas slab with uh, kind of a coyote brown and tan with a thin black liner. A little thread in there, but uh, that was sand through. That's right on the top. First sanding would pop that out. I love the texture of the canvas. See the lines in there? This is really neat stuff, guys. Big slab. Somebody wants to buy that. 30 bucks. Nice, nice slab. I'm real happy with that one. Uh, I've got two more. I've got a... Sorry, I just cleaned them all. I'm still kind of wet. I've got this sweet... Two tan, or it's, I guess it's a tan and a brown burlap. You can see the, the, the tans and the brown, black spacers in between each color. Sorry about the sirens, guys. I do not know what's going on out there. Calling all cars, calling all cars. So, there's a new burlap slab. Pretty sweet, I'm pretty happy with it. That color combo is pretty nice. And, oh, and it's really thick, if you didn't catch that. It's almost a half inch thick. And, something I don't think anybody's seen yet. Something I came up with and found. I don't know which, but orange burlap. Layered with black. You should feel this texture, guys. It is perfect. It is so nice. It is so nice. Look at this thing. It's over a half inch thick. This thing is a beast. 
Oh, this thing is so awesome. It's so heavy. Look how big it is. It is the coolest thing. Super thick. Great color. Great texture. Uh, the camera doesn't even capture it. It is just so cool. This is going to make a great big fat handle for somebody. With some killer texture. I'm so happy with that one. Uh, this one guys would go for 35 just because there is a ton of material in there. I mean, twice as much resin, ton of uh, fabric, you know, uh, the burlap. It's a uh, 5 by 12. It is a big slab. I mean, it's so heavy. So, 35 for that big boy. And if anybody's uh, wanting to custom order something, Still have lots of canvas in different colors, tans, browns, blacks. I can get any other color you want. Um, the uh, burlap came in from Judd. Woo! So there's brown, black, natural, tan, natural, whatever you want to call it. And I can get orange, dark green, light green, and, and blue. Two shades of blue. So. The sale's still on, guys. Um, nobody's done a $100 order, so I still have the uh, three-quarter burlap slab, the old one. Uh, it's about a quarter inch thick. Maybe a little bit thicker than a quarter inch. Still have that. And uh, haven't given away the free slab either. No one's done over 100 bucks. So, a oh, quick update on the knife I've been working on from the steel I got from Chris uh, haven't done much other than cleaned up the uh, the uh, edge break I guess that's what that's called just kind of clean that up a little bit next thing I'm gonna mark the center line do some more grinding on it and clean up the sides that's pretty much it I'm pretty happy with it like that I was trying to decide if I wanted to make more of a clip point there, but I think I'm going to leave it. So, thought I'd give you a quick update on that. Oh, and I sent uh, Brother Marshall some slabs that I never actually put on camera. So, if you guys want to see those, go over to his channel. He's got a couple new slabs that no one's seen yet that I sent straight to him. He's, uh, he said he's going to sand them up and show people show them what the real color looks like so go hit brother marshall up and say hey i want to see that guy carta cool so let me know guys tell your friends sales still going on uh nick man I w i'm sorry i wish you could see the color better i really don't have a way to i promise man it's purple but uh yeah it's a little divot there I'll make you a couple more if you let me know if you want a dark one and a light one or you want them both light like this. Um, man, I wish you could feel these edges. It feels so nice. It's like it's just like plastic. I mean, it's like a little obviously it's stronger than plastic, but it's nice and smooth like plastic. So let me know, Nick. Uh, let me know, guys, if you want to buy the uh, the burlap slabs. Need to uh, get those out of there. Make some way for some more stuff. Got to get some more uh, material and supplies. So, all right. Let me know what you think, guys. Take care. Have a good night.